Everyman Driver Nation, the eagerly awaited Volvo V90 was revealed today, February 18th, in Stockholm, Sweden. The stylish and versatile V90 is the latest in the luxury car maker's top of the line 90 series, sitting alongside the award winning XC90 SUV and the recently launched S90 luxury sedan. So, Robin, the V90, the pinnacle of modern estate, what do you believe sets this vehicle apart? I would uh, say what sets this vehicle apart is the fact it is an elegant design, true to Scandinavian design philosophy. And what's enabled this for us is what we call the SPA platform. This is the scalable product architecture. For exterior design, this has given us fantastic proportions. And let me explain a bit about that proportion. The first one we look at is actually the distance from the center of the wheel to the lower part of the A-post. And we call this the premium dimension. And this sets really that real elegance and premium feel to the car. And because this is the V90, we've also concentrated on the profile. So as you see here, the roof profile, let me turn around. And that brings that down into a very dynamic line at the rear. And now on the front of the car, we have the strong identity of the Thor's Hammer uh, light graphics. And on the rear as well, we also have a strong identity with the lights. So a Volvo can be recognized as you're driving along. So let me look now into the interior and we'll just open the boot. And you can see here the platform also provides us with a very spacious rear compartment. So we've got, uh, with the touch of a button, you can fold down the seats and have a full load area. And in the front of the interior, we have a touchscreen uh, display. Now for an interior designer, this is a dream. It means we reduce the number of switches in the car we can actually then create a true Scandinavian architecture and build into there some beautiful switch details. And of course, the uh, platform also provides the very latest and modern powertrain, uh, including the T8 twin engine hybrid. And of course, Volvo is famous for safety. And uh, for the safety, we've not only this, I mean, this is one of the most safest car in the world, but we've added then two or three features. We have animal detection, pilot assist, and off-road mitigation. So with that combined, we have a very elegant design, uh, true to Scandinavian design. We have the very latest technology, and of course, this is one of the world's safest cars. Yeah. And Robin, natural light and spaciousness is clearly seen throughout the vehicle. Can yeah. you please tell us more about the inspiration behind the sunroof? Yeah, I mean, I used to live in the UK, and coming to Sweden, you suddenly realize how important light is uh, to the, the culture and the people. And you can see this in architecture, that light is absolutely key to, to really the, the well-being of, uh, of your day. So on this car, we've actually put a very large sunroof so that we get plenty of light into the front occupant and into the rear. Oh. And as a designer from the UK, how would you say that the nature, the landscape of Sweden has contributed to the interior design of the car? Yeah, maybe to answer that, let me get into the other side and we can zoom into the interior yes, and then explain it. Yep. Mm -hmm. The new V90 is the third car unveiled in Volvo's top of the line 90 series, all of which are built on the company's specially designed and fully modular, scalable product architecture which has opened up a range of new opportunities in terms of how Volvos can be designed, built, and equipped. The new V90 delivers cutting-edge pilot assist, semi-autonomous drive technology, the most advanced standard safety package on the market, with large animal detection and runoff road mitigation, and class-leading connectivity, including smartphone integration with Apple CarPlay. Okay, so we're in the, the inside of the car. And I'd say the, the one thing we wanted to create with the interior was this uh, almost a taste of Sweden. So when you're um, sat in the car, even if you're in Shanghai, in China, or in America, you get this essence of a Scandinavian living room. Uh, and to create this, there's different levels of things that we introduce. First thing is light, which we talked about, getting lots of light into the cabin. Then there was uh, really bringing in the quality fresh air. That's through filters and ionization but also from a design point of view, bringing in these beautiful air vents either side of the instrument panel. And then of course, to have this influence of nature into the car, we've used some beautiful materials. We've got this um, linear walnut, we have the, the metal work, and with the T8, you have a solid crystal gear lever. And what that uh, brings is, is really elements from nature, but also it's the way we design these, these elements 
that really creates this Scandinavian living room, which is what we're trying to deliver to our customers. And Robin, while I have you in the car, um, we're receiving a lot of questions on social about the sound experience within the 90 series. Yeah. Can you please tell us more about the Bowers and Wilkins system? Okay. I mean, the, the Bowers and Wilkins system is um, 19 speakers throughout the car. We have a fresh air subwoofer in the rear. And on the top here, you can see we have a tweeter placed in the center of the instrument panel. The, uh, the power of the system is 1,400 watts. So this is a really premium sound system. And we work very closely with Baron Wilkins. Um, we meet on a regular basis. We share our philosophies and our design. Um, but most important, we bring the two skill sets together, the, the automa- uh, or the audio guys together with the design team. Uh, and through that, I think we've created something, probably one of the best in the automotive industry. Um, and proof of this, I, I've done it myself. I've pulled up onto my drive and sat in the car and listened to an extra couple of soundtracks. And I've heard this from other people because the quality is fantastic. <laughs> yeah. Last but definitely not least, uh, sensors connectivity. Mm-hmm. Do you mind telling us more about that? Yeah, I mean, sensors connectivity is mainly around this central touchscreen. Um, and it really brings infotainment, navigation, uh, but also connectivity. You can connect your uh, iPhone to the Apple CarPlay. But also it communicates with the central display, um, the steering wheel switch controls, head-up display, and also um, voice activation as well. So it's really the connectivity of all these elements together. Now, what we wanted to do was really um, simplify the interior and that's what this has enabled us to do because we've reduced the amount of switches in the car and I remember as a as a designer earlier sketching the interiors and then a, an engineer would come with lots of switches and components and he'd almost have to start again. This time we actually start with the centre screen. That means that we can build the clean Scandinavian architecture without any compromise making the best of the materials and also introducing some beautiful jewellery details. So this has really achieved what we set out to do, which does make our customers feel really special inside the car. Volvo Cars has also worked tirelessly on driving dynamics in the new model delivering a totally new and refined driving experience characterized by a sense of engaging control and predictability. The new V90 is scheduled to arrive in the US in 2017. For Everyman Driver, I'm Dave Erickson. Thanks for watching.